Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris Man, And as always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. For the last year, I've been documenting what I'm about to say. For the sake of documentation. You know, if something happened to me, and say, okay, well, did, Morris Man did, you know, had these videos. And he talked about some stuff that was going on that was weird in his house. And it's called, you know, here we go with the ghost again. Because I told you guys, like, since I moved here, stuff stopped missing. Uh, now I hear people walking in the hallway at night and I'm saying there's only two of us here and the other person is asleep. And I know somebody didn't break in because I got a, a security system that's like fork knocks. If you got in here, trust me, I would know and you get shot. Just that simple. You know, so I know it's not somebody getting up in here, you know, and like I said, I've been here walking in the hallway. You know, I hear walking in the hallway and when I go out there, I don't see nobody. Don't hear. Don't they don't see anybody. So this is the new thing because I would leave a link down here for some of the other videos because I'm not going to rehash the stuff that I've done already in another video. But if you want to check out the other videos, I'll leave a link down here so you can hear you can hear me talk about these specific incidents, you know, but the new thing is this. Within the last two months, at least four times, my garage door is open. Now, I'm going to say this just for the sake of it could be me. I'm like, OK, maybe I did it once, maybe twice, but four times because it's real simple. I'm the only one that got a key. And when I lock my door, the garage door, I go through this little ritual where you put the key in, you pull the knob up and then you hear the tumbler. <laughs> You can even see the tumble. No, you can't see what you can hear. Click. And then I do this. I rock it back and forth. Make sure it's locked. And it's locked. You know, there's never been a time that I stuck the key in, turned the tumbler, and did that, and it came back open on me. You know, that's why I shake it to make sure that it's locked. So, at least the last four, this happened today. I go out there today. My door is open, and my light is on the side. Now, I'm like, the chances of a human doing that is slim because it would make no sense. Why would somebody run the risk of getting shot? And I stress that come into your yard, get into your garage without a key. Leave the light on. Don't take anything. Don't rumble through, rumble through anything to look for something they might want to take. And if that was the case, they would have took something one of those four times. I surveyed the stuff in my garage. Ain't nothing been moved or taken. Not even moved over or taken. So I'm like, what's going on here? Because I know it ain't me. I know the chances of me not leaving that door or leaving that door open four times within a two-month period. No, I, I, I'm 100% sure, sure it ain't me. Because like I said, even if for the sake of this discussion, it was me twice. But what are the chances that me doing that four times? You know, I'm not going into uh, all-timers yet, you know. I'm still pretty mentally sharp. At least I like to think so. So I just thought I would document this because I'm like, something's opening my garage door. It ain't a human because like I said, what would be the purpose of somebody risking their life, coming onto somebody's property and getting injured or killed for nothing? Ain't nothing in that garage worth risking your life. And once if they got in the first time and realized that they won't come back, it's like ain't nothing in there. So why would I why would I run the risk of getting injured or killed coming up in here again when I know there's nothing in here to take? You know, but I know with 100 percent of surety that it was not me four times. I, I actually don't even want to own up to any times because like I told you, I got to pull up that door and turn that tumbler. And I hear the tumbler slide. And then the, the last part of that process is rocking to make sure that that tumbler's in there and it's locked and it's always locked. I've never done that. Oops, it's still open. You know, so I just thought I would document this because I'm like, I know it ain't me. It's safe to assume that it's not a human because, again, it wouldn't make no sense for a human to keep doing that. And I'm the only one that got the key. You know, if it's locked, you ain't getting in there unless you kick the door down, you know. But I thought I would mention this because, again, I just want to document this. You know, I can't wait to get out of this house. I mean, some of my stuff is already packed. And I'm, I'm just waiting until, you know, the middle part of this year and we're getting up out of here, you know. So until next time, take care and thanks for watching.